I am glad to welcome you to my channel. Today I have prepared for you a selection of cool movies that will change your consciousness. Everyone knows that a good movie can make any evening enjoyable. I'd be happy if you could write a comment with some great movies or TV shows that are definitely worth watching in your opinion. Today's selection opens with the movie. Crossing the Line is a drama that tells the story of a performer named Johnny Carter's difficult journey to the stage of a performer named Johnny Carter. He was born into a poor family with another child. His older brother Jack became a role model for little Johnny, because his father, who got drunk every Friday, could not be a role model was definitely not a good role model. The family survived by working in the field where they picked Cotton Point one day, when Jack wanted to make some extra money, a tragedy struck. Johnny left him alone to cut the neighbor's firewood while he went fishing. The accident took Jack's life. My father blamed Johnny for everything, he even wanted him to die and his eldest son to come back. It was good that at least his mother was on the younger son's side and protected him. The family's life changed a lot after that. As he grew up, the protagonist left his parents' house and started looking for ways to break into the world of music. At the same time, he fell in love with a girl whom he later married. My angel. Lizzie is an emotionally depressed woman who still can't come to terms with the tragic loss of her of her daughter that happened many years ago. Visits to a psychiatrist helped to stabilize her condition for a while, but a difficult divorce and the possibility of losing custody of her son have a negative impact on her psyche. One day at a children's party, Lizzie meets her neighbor Claire, who lives in a luxurious house with her husband and her daughter Lola. The girl reminds Lizzie of her lost child, so she begins to follow her and after a while, the woman convinces herself that Lola is her daughter, who needs to be returned. The drama My Angel is an American adaptation of a French film released in 2008. Swedish actress Numi Rapace was invited to play the lead role, who is more familiar with the role of a militant, determined woman than a mother, than a mother who has lost a child. The movie was shot in Melbourne, Australia. If you have already watched this movie, please write a comment or review. Miracles from Heaven. This incredible story happened to an ordinary American family, living in the town of Burleson, located in the state of Texas. Christy and Martin Beam have been happily married for over 10 years, together raising three charming daughters. A large cozy house, a beautiful spacious yard and cheerful children's laughter, it would seem that there will be no limit to the happiness of a married couple. But suddenly Christy learns that her 10-year-old daughter Anna is seriously ill. The girl is diagnosed with a chronic pathology of the digestive system, which modern medicine is powerless against. Unable to accept the horrific diagnosis, the distraught mother tries her best to help her child, but her desperate attempts do not bring the desired result. And at the moment when the unfortunate couple has already given up on their couple had already given up, and in this hopeless situation they could only to believe and hope that everything would be fine, a real miracle happened. While playing with her sisters, Anna climbed a tall tree and as a result of an accident falls from a height of 10 meters. An ambulance arrives and finds no fractures or internal injuries and internal organ damage and diagnoses the child with only multiple bruises. Moreover, after a thorough examination of the girl, the doctors were surprised to come to the conclusion that all signs of chronic pathology had disappeared and the girl was absolutely healthy. The Observer The plot centers on a married couple raising two children. They move to a new house, hoping that this place will allow them to start life from scratch, leaving misunderstandings and resentments in the past, however, their idol is disrupted by strange messages left under the door by a mysterious, a mysterious stranger who calls himself the observer. Every day the characters feel more and more in danger. Will they be able to find a way out of the situation? And what does the stranger want from their family? Tablets of Fate In her youth, Roseanne McNulty was a charming beauty who loved life. But fate happened so that she found herself in the walls of a psychiatric clinic, where spent so much time there that everyone had forgotten why she was there. After taking the position of head physician, Dr. Green immediately became interested in the mysterious patient. One day, he accidentally found her diary, where she had been writing down all her decades she had been writing down all her memories. After studying the materials, the man learned the secret of her conclusions and the incredible story of an all-consuming, passionate and very tragic love. The Boy in the Smoggy Pajamas the movie is suitable for all fans of historical dramas. A strong, sad, touching, and instructive military historical drama about war, cruelty, cunning, hypocrisy, and humanity inherent in children. The story is set during the Second World War. The plot centers on the story of Bruno, a boy whose father is a high-ranking Nazi official. After his father's appointment as a concentration camp commander, 
Bruno's family moves to the countryside. In the neighborhood of his new home, Bruno discovers a strange farm with unusual people. They wear striped pajamas, play numbers sewn onto their pajamas, and burning old clothes in large ovens for some reason, so black smoke often comes out of the long chimneys. Black smoke coming out of the long chimneys. Among these people, Bruno finds a new friend. Which movie will you watch first? Please write in the comments.